The first song we'll be singing is Wonderful Life from Warner Bros. Smallfoot. Migo is a friendly Yeti whose world gets turned upside down when he discovers something that he didn't know existed, a human. He soon faces banishment from his snowy home when he, the rest of the villagers refuse to believe his fantastic tale. Hoping to prove them wrong, Migo's, Migo embarks on an epic journey to find the mysterious, mysterious creature that can put him back in the good graces of with this simple community. The next song we'll be singing is, in, is a German art song, ger, originally composed by the soul, as a solo by Schubert. Die Ferretta, translated from German to English, is The Trout. We will be singing in both German and English, and please, and, and the story is about a playful trout that doesn't have the best ending. Please enjoy Wonderful Life in Die Ferretta. Like 
of some of our favorite Disney songs. Arranged by Alan Billingsley, you will hear selections from Moana, Brave, Mulan, Tangled, and Hercules. Please enjoy this arrangement and the final piece of our chorale concert. Please be 
in Defying Gravity, originally from Wicked, but tonight I will be singing a version a little different, which might sound familiar if you are familiar with the show Glee. I chose this song because in a few days I will officially be done with high school and will be starting a new chapter of my life. I believe this upcoming chapter connects with this song because no one knows what will happen in this chapter, but no matter what, I will conquer it with all my strength and courage. Now before I sing, I would like to just say thank you, and I'm so glad that I got to sing with all these amazing singers, and I've grown so much thanks to my family and Mrs. Rock. and then the other part would be singing as Peyton's part from the other side of the church. The German translates, Er he remik, O answer me, Er he remik then ich rufe, O answer me when I call you. Peyton and I sang this song at State Southern Ensemble Contest and received a Division I rating, and I'm so glad I get to sing with her one last time before I graduate.
singers will be performing for you is Unwritten by Natasha Benfield. This song really represents our key word in power, with lyrics as, the pen's in my hand, ending on the <coughs> meaning the future is yours to write, the path is up to you and you only. One of our own students, Ray Blanken, choreographed this song. We would also like to extend a special thank you to the Foundation for Public Schools and their grant for our gender neutral uniforms. So, without further ado, Unwritten.
will be found from Dear Evan Hansen. Mrs. Rowe gave me the chance to create this choreography, and she even rewrote the music so we can perform it like I envisioned it in my head. Hmm. Musical theater was my safe space when I was younger, Hamilton and Dear Evan Hansen being my favorites. So being able to introduce this piece to my new safe space, my home, means everything to me. Thank you to the eight who I see every day for being my family, and thank you to my best friend for finding me. I extend a special thanks to Mrs. Rowe for making me feel like I belong in my freshman year. I the world all of you. We may not yet have reached our goal, but I will gladly join the fight.
the difference is together we are bolder, braver, stronger.
I'm Jamari Jackson. I will be singing I Love Thee by Beethoven. she would have become. She misses her happiness, her liveliness, and her true self. I chose the song because, like many others, my senior year had turned out to be very difficult. I went through a period where I felt as though I'd lost my sparkle, my happiness, and I'd forgotten who I was. Um, but I am finally feeling like myself again, and I've gained control over my own happiness. So this song is bittersweet to me as it describes I, the way I felt during such a hard time, yet I can't help but be proud of how much I've grown. Mm -hmm. It's not easy to say that most days I don't recognize me. These shoes in this sacred, this place and its patrons have taken more than I gave them. It's not easy to know I'm not anything like I used to be, although it's true I was never attention the sweet center. I still remember that girl. She's imperfect, but she tries. She is good, but she lies. She is hard on herself. She is broken and won't ask for help. She is messy, but she's kind. She is love. Most of the time she's all of this. 
Spirit Chamber Choir, an audition choir that meets once a week to prepare dif different and challenging music pieces that contrast and complement each other with directors Mrs. Rowe and student director Kale Spires. <laughs> Our first piece is Now is the Month of May by Thomas Morley, published in 1595. This song is about a man who sings to his love who does not accept it. This song incorporates metered and metric rhythms with large leaps and bouncy lyrics with different sequence of notes for each part. Our second piece is I Hear Oceans by Jacob Navarud. This mysterious song begins with the simple call of I Hear Oceans and melts into luscious chords, writing that expresses the image of something powerful and vast both in the world and within each one of us. Inspire Choir performed this song at the 2022 Solon Ensemble Contest, receiving a Division I. And our closing piece is Nella Fantasia, arranged by Audrey Snyder with music by Morricone. It is an Italian song based on the theme from Gabriel's oboe for the movie The Mission in 1986. It is a classical crossover with switching melodies between each of the voice parts. The lyrics of Nella Fantasia translate to, In my fantasy, I see a world of justice where all people live in peace and harmony. We would like to give a special thank you to Mrs. Rowe, who sacrifices her time to work with us and create such strong, dependable friends and musicians. Sadness, la 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 la. 
The piece I'll be singing is called Astonishing from the Little Women musical. In this piece, the character singing, Joe, was proposed to by Lori. However, she rejects him because she doesn't want to settle down and live an average life. She wants to have the freedom to continue to pursue her dreams of being a writer. And by graduating from high school, I now also have that freedom to pursue something astonishing. <laughs>
entire concert. But really, that's a lie, obviously. Sorry it's long, but I'm really not sorry. Just look at this. <laughs> you guys. There's so many talented soloists. Our seniors are incredible. Incredible pianists that just learned how to play piano because they wanted to, and now they're playing in front of all these people. These they are people. very, really. Yeah. It's it's really a cool, really a cool opportunity. However, we have a really weird teacher. It's just <laughs> the truth. Uh, she's kind of cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs, if you know what I mean. <laughs> um, but it's okay because um, you know I, I mean I could just do better. Oh. It's true, I could. I could just do better. <laughs> yeah, easily. This guy, oh, listen up. Anything you can do, I can do better. I can do anything better than you. No, you can't. Yes, I can. No, you can't. Yes, I can. No, you can't. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Anything you can be, I can be greater. Sooner or later, I'm greater than you. Yes, I am. No, you're not. Yes, I am. No, you're not. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. I can teach the choirs every single week. I can sing a solo with perfect technique. I can <laughs> win awards with ease. Well, I've seen you do that. Yeah? It's meh, not bad. Oh. <laughs> anything you can sing, I can sing higher. I can say anything higher than you. No, you can. Yes, I can. No, you can. Yes, I can. Oh, 
can't, can't, can't. Yes, I can, can, can. Yes, no, you I can't. Resilience, strength, and belief in oneself are just some of the themes present in our next song, Then I Ever Knew. This song, written by Connor Cuppin, was originally intended for the 2020 Opus 9th grade honest honor choir before it was sadly canceled due to the spread of COVID-19. It was, instead, performed at the 2021 Opus Honor Choir Festival, where our very own Sophia Kazire was present in the premiere. This piece, just like many of other Many other of Coppin's work is a great opportunity for having important conversations with young people about how we, un how we respond to the unexpected. Our second selection comes from the musical The Sound of Music. We draw attention to life's pos positives like drain raindrops, <laughs> thumb roses, and whiskers on kittens. And we remind ourselves to simply remember our favorite things and then we don't feel so bad. Please enjoy the Hempstead Concert Choir.
since growing up. Most of us have been friends for years and have truly grown up together. One of the song's writers was inspired by his daughter who he felt was growing up too fast. He commented, every parent knows the feeling. Even if you were with them every waking hour, you still feel that you were missing something. The song was also used in a movie as a mother sings about her daughter growing up too fast and missing out on the little moments of life. As we seniors have our final days at Hempstead, we've seen that four years really do go by fast, and as we try to make up for the lost moments, we are going to make as many memories as we can. All of us would like to thank our families, our friends, our fellow choir members, anyone else who has helped us along the way, and Mrs. Rowe, for the endless amounts of support and opportunities we have received. You've all left a huge impact on our lives, and we hope we've made an impact on yours, too. So, as we try to drown our feelings of sadness, we will smile and enjoy the time we have left in this environment with these people. This year's sen senior song, written by Betty Anderson and Bjorn Yulubes, sung by Ava and in the movie Mamma Mia, is slipping through my fingers.
recognize the name and sound of our next piece, You Raise Me Up. The words for this breathtaking arrangement of You Raise Me Up were written by Rolf Loveland and Brendan Grant. And the piece was arranged by Mark Hayes. You Raise Me Up is an incredible song made popular by Josh Brogan. It was created to make the listener truly feel and believe in their inner spirituality and happiness. Hempstead Choir sings this song every year to thank our family, friends, and everyone who has supported us throughout our years. If you are a Hempstead Choir alum, please join us on stage to perform You Raise Me Up.
offer awards for everything the students have participated in throughout the entire year. So in some special envelopes that they're going to get during class, they'll receive participation certificates for every choir they've been a part of this year, every honor choir, every all-state student, every oldest student, um, and every solo ensemble participant they'll receive in the envelopes. I won't announce each individual student tonight, but we'll stick to some of the, um, the superior ratings and the distinguished awards this evening. So, um, students, first we're going to announce the superior ratings at State Solo and Ensemble Contest. When I say your name, please do stand so people can applaud for you. At contest, these soloists receive superior ratings. Abigail Tyler, Jaden Vasilega, Jaden Isaacs, Leah Olachowski, Liza Trotter, Lucas Tyler, Maria Mustafa, Peyton Reed, Ray Blanken, Sophia Kazire, Caleb Spires, and Caleb was given a perfect score and awarded the outstanding performance of the day. Congratulations. <laughs> Sophia Kazire, Liza Trotter and Caleb Spires, Maggie Meehan and Peyton Reed, and ensemble members in Spirit Chamber Choir and the Shenandoah Treble Quartet. Congratulations to you all. <laughs> um, inside of their envelopes, they also receive little gold bars for every 150 points, which is every activity they participated in gains them points. So uh, first time letter winners earning 100 points are the following students, who can please stand when I read your name? Brooklyn Bennett, Forrest Brooks, Caitlin Danielson, Chloe Hansen, Cortland Hudson, Grant Kelly, Sophia Kazire, Jillian Myers, Scarlett Mishai Beckler, Justin Moots, Sadie Newsom, Leah Norton, Isabella Russell, Gabrielle Syke, Drew Smith, Sophia Smith, Liza Trotter, and Alexa Vasky. First time letter winner. <laughs> These students earning first, second, and third gold bars, earning up to and exceeding 550 points in participation. Aaron Digman, Maya England, Lucas Federanich, Gabriel Green, Woo! Evelyn Harbin, Jordan Hudson, Chase Holman, Jamari Jackson, Woo! Sophia Kazire, Olivia Cryer, Jillian Myers, Maggie Meehan, Maria Mustafa, Leah Olachowski, Baden Huang, Peyton Reed, Owen Smith, Asher Safi, Liza Trotter, Anna Tyler, and Lucas Tyler. <laughs> Students earning their fourth, fifth, and sixth gold bars, earning up to and exceeding a thousand points of participation. Jaden Vasilega, Jordan Hudson, Maggie Meehan, Mario Mustafa, Peyton Reed, and Caleb Spires. <laughs> Earning a seventh, eighth, and an added level of a ninth bar with a total of 1,460 points of participation in singing all the time, Mr. Caleb Spires. <laughs> to have 14 students audition for the Iowa All-State Choir. Congratulations for the second year in a row to Miss Peyton Reed for being accepted. trophies and medals for their service to the choral program. They serve in the roles of choir counsel, teaching assistants, and choreographers. Students, please stand or come to the stage when your name is announced. Maggie Meehan, choir president, alto section leader. Asher Sapi, vice president, bass section leader. 
Jordan Hudson, Secretary, Soprano Section Leader. Maria Mustafa, Treasurer, Soprano Section Leader. Peyton Reed, Tenor Section Leader. Owen Smith, Tenor Section Leader. Caleb Spires, Student Director and Section Leader. Jamari Jackson, Public Relations. Lucas Tyler, Public Relations. Aiden Kwam, Public Relations. Anna Tyler, Public Relations. Leah Olachowski, Librarian. And Jaden Vasilega, thank you for your service to our group. Next are the Corral Choir Teaching Assistants. They will be receiving trophies for their help with the entry level choir, which is Corral. A lot of younger students, and they have been superior role models for these students. Lucas Federanich, Maggie Meehan, Mario Mustafa, Asher Sapi, and Caleb Spires. For choreography and dance captains, our dance captain for the musical, The Adams Family, spectacular Jordan Hudson. <laughs> choreography medals for our Penath members, Ray Blanken, Scarlett Mishai <laughs> Beckler, Forrest Brooks, Aaron Digman, Danielle Blosh, and Jillian Myers. ways to make music together both near and far. One of our first experiences with this friend of Hempstead occurred in a virtual voice lesson where I witnessed some of the most incredible vocal teaching on belting technique. The impact of the teaching was in no way lessened, even though we were all the way across town from each other. Throughout the next two years, this friend of Hempstead would continue to provide virtual and soon in-person lesson to several of our students and to me. He worked with our all-state singers, our musical cast members, and students who simply wanted more focused teaching from a vocal specialist. He consistently opened his schedule, made himself available for our students' benefit. He's a brilliant voice scientist, and he'll be moving on from Dubuque this summer to begin a program in speech and language pathology on the East Coast. So we thank him for all of the knowledge, time, and care he has shared with our Hempstead students. We present the Friend of Hempstead Award to our dear friend and supporter from Clark University, Dr. Josh Glasser. We are graduating 18 incredible seniors, and I cherish every single one of you. The Quincy Jones Award. Quincy Jones's career encompassed the role of composer, record producer, artist, film producer, arranger, conductor, vocalist, instrumentalist, television producer, record company executive, magazine founder, and multimedia entrepreneur. <laughs> every spring, a Hempstead 
vocal music student earns the Quincy Jones Award for contributions and creativity in multiple areas of music. This year's recipient has experience in the following musical areas. Piano lessons for eight years, former and current involvement in chorale choir, concert choir, chamber choir, section leader, teaching assistant, candidate and participant in the Iowa Allstate Choir, solo ensemble contests, dance lessons, lead and feature roles, singing and dancing in the musicals, Broadway bound, and she is an excellent cellist. Please join me in congratulating this student awarded for contributions and creativity in multiple areas of music, Maggie Meehan. musicianship and leadership. This year there were three seniors in particular who really stood out to me with these qualities. Two of them sort of come as a pair. Both are eager to learn as much as they can about music, always asking thoughtful advanced questions about things that we study. Together they can be found leading bass sectionals by coaching and playing pitches on the piano while attempting to maintain order <laughs> with a calm and respectful demeanor. They are both capable of standing in front of a large group at a moment's notice and leading stretches and warm-ups while I tend to other business in the classroom. They lead with both care and humor, and they are loved by many. The third recipient has incredible attention to detail, as shown in her music markings. She writes down every single helpful note in order to create a beautiful musical performance, as well as coach her soprano section in artistic decisions. She's musically self-sufficient and is one of the most reliable and responsible members of our ensembles. The awards for outstanding musicianship and leadership are presented to Asher Sapi, Lucas Federanich, and Jordan Hudson. Association Award recognizes a student who has demonstrated superior musicianship, outstanding leadership, and personal growth in all aspects of the choral art. This student exemplifies all the qualities listed for this award. She leads with a humble and patient demeanor, and her peers feel confident learning from her, especially in her position as a teaching assistant. She is a superior musician whose skills have greatly increased every year throughout her participation in choir, musicals, and solo and ensemble contests. She is hilariously quick-witted and very bright and has earned thousands of dollars in music scholarships for college because of her advanced skills and knowledge. Congratulations to the recipient of the ICDA Outstanding Senior Choral Award, Maria Mustafa. <laughs> The National School Choral Award is given to both a male and female choir member. The qualifications state, in recognition of singular merit, ability, and achievement, of outstanding contributions to the success of the vocal program, and of an unusual degree of loyalty, cooperation, and high qualities of conduct. This young man and woman have demonstrated the utmost loyalty to our music program, and they always treat adults and their peers with respect. They are sources of positivity and humor on a daily basis, and they help sustain a strong foundation for our choirs. They are trusted, respected, and greatly admired by all of our singers. These highly talented singers care very much about music, about our program, and about the people around them. The National School Choral Awards are hereby conferred upon Caleb Spires and Maggie Meehan. ceremony in just a minute we'll finish our evening with an encore and a farewell performance by Caleb Spires. A special thank you to our administration, 
my music and theater colleagues, as well as those who assisted with lights, sound, video, stage setup, lobby monitoring, and chaperoning in the choir room. We also extend a uh, thank you to our fabulous accompanist, the Queen Jo Kleinbrill, and to our magnificent choreographer, Caitlin Soat. I'm extremely honored to have taught these incredible young adults for the past four years at Hempstead. I'll dearly miss all of them uh, as I'm moving to the Bellevue Community School District next year. Um, parents and guardians, thanks for raising such amazing people. to the stage to sing one final selection from The Lord of the Rings called The Last Goodbye. Thank you. 
Farewell.